I chose the Peace Drone XR from Experimental Airlines to be my newest uh, aerial video plane. It's going to have the iPod in the front and possibly also a new uh, digital camera mount with a servo mechanism for still frames. So I'm going to introduce you to this new plane. It's 30 inches long and 60 inches wide for the back wing and then for the front wing it's 30 inches. It's all made out of Dollar Tree foam board. Uh, sometimes with the paper on, like this still has the paper on the outside, uh, but this is all paper layer removed. I employed some of the build techniques that he uses for this plane, like the wing construction. Instead of having a base and a lot of little ribs to cut out and then a top plate to go over it, instead it's one piece beveled down the center with a piece of tape on the opposite side and then cut out these foam spacers there's two of them in here and three of them in here and add whatever support you want on the inside and then fold that over glue it on the spacers and glue it on the back put weights on top of it and it makes a really nice light uh, airfoil shape this is a five inch cord and a seven inch cord for the back wing uh, just foam with tape for the uh, vertical stabilizers three channel bank and yank uh, I opted not to put landing gear on it because it seems light enough and landing gear is kind of a hassle. Uh, the foam the foam board tube style uh, cockpit or battery area that kind of turned out well but it kind of it got warped from the back it got kind of twisted so I had to add a little space under this underneath this wing to get it parallel with that. It's got two different hatches for when the camera is not on it the battery goes way up in the front because it's really tail heavy but when the iPod is on the front the battery sits about here this is a access hatch to the receiver and ESC and all of the wings are removable for easy transport and also not just transport but if I have a crash it will move and give a little give instead of just snapping and breaking the motor is a 910 kV uh, 3536 motor from Turnigy and the speed controller is this yellow one I bought off eBay but it's supposedly Turnigy as well this wing's a 10 by 6 wooden prop um, I th this I think that power system is going to be perfect for this plane because it powered my Mega AV, which is like eight feet wingspan and really heavy, and this plane is substantially smaller and lighter, so should not have a problem. So I'm gonna go maiden it here soon, and hopefully you guys will see some successful aerial video. Keep up with this project and subscribe to my channel. Thanks.